have two separate boxes that are part of my color system. The first three DVDs cover the essential setup of these boxes, but here's the dominant box that's going to be used in almost every single one of the paintings that are overcast light and twilight situations. The colors that we find in these boxes, titanium white, my cool yellow, which is Hansa yellow, Azo yellow, a lemon yellow, just nothing with cadmium in it, yellow ochre, that's my light cool orange, alizarin crimson, and the alizarin crimson that is equivalent in your acrylics is quinacridone magenta, and you can also use quinacridone if you can get it in oils too. Down in the green box we have the cool green, which is phthalo green. It's a lovely turquoise when white is added to it. The blue that we use is ultramarine blue. And finally, the last color is my earth tone, which is burnt umber. That's a dark, cool orange. Now, the setup of the box is by value, from lightest to dark. I know that in prior DVDs I've set it up differently, but as time evolves and I use them more frequently, I tend to find that setting them up by value from lightest to dark makes it easier for me to make better color choices. My warm box, which I use a lot less, perhaps only 5% of a painting when I do a misty overcast, if I use it at all, I still have my titanium white on the, on the left side, and it goes again in value right down through the colors. Titanium white, cadmium yellow, medium, cadmium orange, cadmium red light, sap green, phthalo blue, and burnt sienna.